Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Bree Brands Cradle. I just got back from the mail. <laughs> I, uh, I have another happy mail. Thank you so much. This is from Julie at the Country Cottage. <clears throat> and excuse my voice, the last couple of days we had um, sports events at the school. Uh, it's called Frontier Games. And it's kind of like an Olympics when schools come together and compete. And um, this afternoon I was like <laughs> cheering, cheering some teams on and <laughs> shout out to all the students, new and old, that I've... <laughs> That I saw at the Frontier Games. It was so nice to see everyone. So here I have Kelbri and this is Jerica. Jerica Delaney. She is my Ping Lao sculpt, the Sansa sculpt. Um, and this one is a Polly sculpt that I just recently opened from Kelly. And actually, both of these dolls are from Kelly. Kelly is Kelly's Weekend Nursery on Reborns.com. She still has many dolls available. She's a wonderful artist. I love her work. These two are not from her work, though. They're from her personal collection. But still, I love her dolls so much. She, like, I don't know if she uh, reweighted any of them. This one here has her original body that's signed by the artist, which is really cool. I didn't really notice that. But, and this beautiful one is a replica um, that I bought from Amazon. And I, I forget her name. I'm going to have to look it up. And in fact, she doesn't even have a name. I received her around the time when my dad passed away, so um, I have a couple of dolls from that time that I never really had a chance to spend some time with, but um, my friend Daisy, hi Daisy, uh, she suggested that I dress this little one, so I put her hair up into pigtails very quickly and dressed her, and she looks so cute. She does not have a name right now. Uh, when I look at her, I think of a uh, Kiera, or um, I'm not sure yet, or even like a Karina. I'm not sure yet, but this one here is Kelbri. So while I natter on and on and on, I am going to move these beautiful dolls. And this is Kelbri. And my birthday is tomorrow, so this couldn't have come at a perfect time, Julie. <laughs> I thank you so much. I knew that this was coming. Um, I knew that the okay, our addresses are everywhere. Her address and my address, but there are stickers like all over it. <laughs> so cute, and she has some more stickers, and there are more stickers. Okay, I will be back, and I'll open this, um, well, to, to cover up the addresses. <laughs> so I open this up, and look at these cute little petals. They're beautiful. I love, this is my favorite color, like, of pink ever. And it's for Zeta. I knew it was for Zeta as well. Uh, Julie, Julie told me about this is coming for from Esme to Zeta. <laughs> but look how cute that is. Oh look, these are so pretty. <laughs> so she sent them to me like this so I can reuse them. It's so cool. Thank you, Julie. These are so pretty. Okay, let's get to the card. Oh. 
Before I open this, I just want to say thank you to everyone for supporting my channel. And Julie, thank you so much for this. I need, <laughs> you don't know how much this brings a smile to my face and to my heart. Um, my birthday is tomorrow, so it can't come at a better, better time. This is my first birthday without um, my dad. So, who saved my life, by the way? I was supposed to be born in April. Honestly, I was supposed to be born in mid-April, but I was born February 3rd. So, I am extremely a premature baby. Anyways, let's get to this. Thank you, Julie. This, <laughs> this is wonderful. This is, okay, I can't. I'm going to adjust my eyes here. I started to send this card for no special occasion. <laughs> so cute. I'm sorry. Oh, look. Dear Zeta and Auntie Bren. But thinking of you made it one. Oh, so cute. My mommy and I love you both very much. I hope you love your goodies. From me, love your cousin Esme. That's so cute. That is so cute. <laughs> I love that. Oh, look, there's goodies for her. She is going to love this, and I am going to have to have one of these as well. I'll have the big one, and Zeta can have these. Oh, thank you. And Zeta can probably share, too. Oh, there's a few of them. Thank you. And look, more beautiful petals. Okay, where to start? Ooh. Okay, I'm going to... I hope I don't bump it into the tripod again. Okay. Let's try this. Oh, this is beautiful. Wow, I love it. Oh, Zeta will love this. It's beautiful. Oh, <laughs> her new favorite. Oh my goodness. Pegasus. Is it not? I know it's a unicorn, but isn't there a Pegasus? A Pegasus came to my mind. I wonder if I'm right or wrong. Wow, that's so pretty. Oh, it was beautiful. And Zeta is not here right now. She is napping. Oh, wait, what's this? Thank you for sharing these baby bracelets. Aww. Cool. <laughs> I'm smiling so much. Thank you. Okay, how about this one? <laughs> I'm smiling so much. Thank you so much, Julie. Oh, look at this. It's a, what's it? Dream big. Oh, definitely. Definitely. Oh, and look, it matches. <laughs> I love it. This is so perfect. I'm so happy I was able to check the mail today. Look at the oh, and these even match these socks. <laughs> I love this theme. Of course, I knew I smelled this. I love. I do this too. I've been doing this for many, many, many years, and I love doing this. But thank you. I love this new sachet. Ooh, I love these. I collect pacifiers. If you go back to my videos of my pacifier collection, it was quite huge. And I would love to add these to that collection. <laughs> oh, look at this beautiful pink. Is this one of those baths? Oh, wait. Is there something inside? It's a towel, a blanket. Oh, look, some clothes for her. So we can do some twinning videos. I love this. This, like, remember what um, Calvary came with? Items like this. I love it. And this, too. Love you. 
Oh, it's beautiful. Perfect for spring coming up. By the way, it does feel like spring here. Everything is melting. It's plus 7 degrees Celsius, which is... Hey, Google, what's plus 7 into Fahrenheit? On the website QMath.com, they say, Answer, temperature at 7 degrees Celsius is equal to the temperature at 44.6 degrees Fahrenheit. 44 degrees Fahrenheit to me is very hot for this time of year. Normally, no joke, we're at minus 40 degrees, and that's both in Celsius and Fahrenheit. So plus 7 to us is extremely hot. Oh, look at this magical baby. It's a book. I love it. I can't wait to read this with her. I'm going to have to do a video, a role play video with her. I just have to. <laughs> Thank you, Julie, for giving me this beautiful gift for my birthday just in time. <sighs> I hope tomorrow I have time to do a role play video with Zeta. Oh, I love this. I love this. I love this. I love this magical babies. <laughs> Thank you so much, Julie. <laughs> I love it so much, Julie. Thank you so much for everything. By the way, guys, this is my uh, Frontier School Division logo. There. Oh, what? Something just went out. That's okay. My school division is the largest school division in Manitoba, Canada, which is where I live. And the school where I work is in Area 4. There are five different areas. And the Frontier School Division is quite huge. It consists of, I'm not sure how many schools, but I know probably over 3,000 teachers altogether. There are five areas. <sighs> But yes, we had Frontier Games in hosted by our school. So we were housing the kids for overnight. Uh, we were feeding them. Um, and of course, the games it was wonderful. And I got to see some of my kids that I used to teach in different communities. Oh, my current kids. Hi. <laughs> I get, it was so lovely to see everyone. The last time I taught there was three years ago and they still remember me. It was awesome. I, I didn't even recognize one of them at first. She was looking at me and looking at me and almost like confused. I'm like, yeah. But then I recognized her and then she started talking with Alan. So, and uh, yeah. It was wonderful to see all of you, both my girls and my boys, and say hi to my other kids who did not come to Frontier Games. But I miss you guys all. And of course, my kids now that I have my students now. <laughs> oh, you guys, it's wonderful. And tomorrow is my birthday. My birthday, my birthday. I will be 51 years old. <sighs> 51. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me. I love you all. Thank you so much for being here. And hopefully I can get back to doing some regular videos. As you can see, my dad's things are still um, not put away yet. I still need to think of a, a place for them, a home for them. I did uh, put up some more pictures that I have of his up on the wall. They look wonderful. They fit in here so beautifully. But still sad times too. So, yeah, I'll just leave it at that. Um, thank you again, Julie, for everything. You stood by me when I really needed someone. And Julie knows exactly what I'm talking about, but she was the one, she was the one that supported me and publicly supported me with her opinions people know where Julie stands that's for sure Julie I appreciate you so much I love you so much and everyone else who's been with me for years and years and years thank you so much for everything for being here I am close to 15,000 subscribers can you believe it oh my goodness <laughs> I was going to do a giveaway but 
As me, I already have in mind of a giveaway person, so I can't wait to do a box packing video in the near future. <laughs> so stay tuned for that. Anyways, guys, thank you again for being here. So much love, thank you, and support. Comment down below. I will definitely get back to you. I love all of you guys. And until next time, very, very soon, I hope. I'm still learning how to do that new editor. <laughs> Bye guys. Match hand. Bye guys. I love you. Bye guys. Bye for now.